whole cookout with porn on the big screen. You know, there's a, there was a place in Tampa that used to do that. At the bowling alley I used to bowl at in college, there was a really diabolical place across the street that would play porn on a projector outside. And it was a bar. So you go and you just drink and they play porn. And there's also a place that still does this. They call it Pornioki, where they just play porn during karaoke nights. I haven't been to Pornioki, but Aaron and Chelsea went once, and apparently, I don't know if they're just fucking with me or not, but apparently one of the people who went up and did karaoke sang 2019 Guy, which I think is so fitting for that environment. And it tickled me. Do you moan to the music or just have to sing with porn playing over everything? It's normal karaoke, there's just porn playing. Why? I don't know, quirky, I guess. Never been to a porn theater. What is that? What the fuck is that? A porn theater? God, the gooning is reaching apocalyptic levels. Porn theater is old, that's what Pee Wee Herman was arrested for? I thought he went to just like a normal public theater and jerked. You're telling me it was like a... Like, that was the activity? Like, it was a planned thing? Why was he arrested then? It was a theater meant for it, too. It was a porn theater for some reason you're only allowed to watch. <laughs> I love that. Alright, come on into the porn theater. We're playing some really incredible stuff. Oh, you sick freak! Put your dick away! What are you doing? In, a, in an establishment like this, you, you've got some nerve! Security! Say, get this degenerate out of here! In my porn theater? Why, I never! Edging only zone. <laughs> I guess so. I had no idea. I thought the whole Pee Wee Herman thing was he just went to a normal theater and started masturbating. That changes everything. That man went to a public communal goon cave. Like, what do you expect? I'm sure everyone in there was, <laughs> like, beating their meat. I don't know why they... they Brought the hammer down on him. You ever had a lucid dream? I had a lucid dream one time. I still remember it. It's the only lucid dream that I can actually recall. I realized that I was dreaming and I was in control of the dream. And the first thing I did was put a dinosaur in the dream and... <laughs> that was really about it. Uh, there was nothing cool. I was like, ah, yeah, yeah, I can do that. You watch the trailer for the game Kingmakers? Oh, I keep forgetting to do that. I wanted to look this up earlier and forgot. We don't know where he came from. But I'll tell you, he built our village into a city. He's the one who trained our army. Who grew us into an empire. I don't know where he's from. But if you think you can stop him... You're already dead. Oh, that was an interesting twist. This is cute. It did not golden, I'm sorry to say. It's pretty cool. Days gone, like, huh? Days gone. That's pretty cool. Any tips on how to get better at speedrunning? Been hard stuck at 25 minutes for Poppy Playtime 3. It's just practice, man. That's all. It's just practice. Delta Force trailer? What's that? Oh, I'd, I'd win for sure, Rex. I'm good at pole dancing. 
I heard Talon, I'll have to check it out. So what kind of game is this? Like a tactical FPS? They stole my blueprints, broke my lines of production, and cracked my foundation. It kind of reminds me of that game Blacklight Retribution, if anyone remembers that. Even though Blacklight Retribution was a lot more sci-fi, I just get a similar vibe. Balance must be pursued at all costs, and the balance will be due, whether with them or even myself. What happened to Blacklight Retribution? Did it just slowly fade out and then they shut down? That game was fun. Yeah, I got nothing out of that. I still don't even know what kind of shooter it is. I'd really like to know what kind of game you'd come up with. Oh, I've got a banger idea for a game. I just need a studio that will actually do it. We've been cooking an idea for a game for years. It's so good, too. Like, no, it's not a horror game at all. Why would I make a horror game? That's like the main genre of game I shit on. Because they're all bad. You're about the Australian man who shoved several batteries into his wiener. As shocking as this is, I did not hear about that guy. I don't keep up with the sounding newsletter.